So in 2008, I was photographing this Sufi celebration in South Pakistan, and on the edge of the celebration, in a in a in a garden, I saw this group of people uh, that were wearing black and just look really different. And uh, I went and talked to them, and they are like, "Well, we're heading out in a few days across the desert for this pilgrimage." Uh, back then, they would cross Baluchistan, and um, it was quite lawless, and it was too dangerous. And anyway, I had no plan to do that. It's a big, you needed to be prepared. So I couldn't do it, um, And but it stuck in my head that one day I would love to do it when the situation would get better. And so um, I returned to Pakistan in 2021 20, with this idea to go back to this Sufi celebration and try and find them in the same garden. <laughs> and I did. It was unreal. Uh, I went with a friend in 2021. So we walked with them. Eventually, we asked them like spontaneously, can we just join you? And they were OK. Um, and we did a small movie and I photographed the whole um, trip more uh, as a documentation of the daily life and the struggle of the walk because it is extremely challenging in terms of you have to carry everything with you it's extremely hot um, and and yeah you're just fully exposed to the elements you sleep out they barely sleep these guys are like really tuned into the environment and me dropped in like that I wasn't so it was very very challenging but we managed and then in 2022 I wanted to return uh, and really specifically focus on the portraiture of these people. What had mostly impressed me is their kindness and proximity and how love with a big L is really their guiding light, always in life. Um, as in one of the first um, time I saw them, I did ask if I could take a picture and the guy looked at me like questioning, like, are you going to do it with love and kindness? And I was, well, yeah, yeah, I think so. Yeah, I mean, how else? If you're doing it, love is in kindness. You can do anything. Don't worry about it. Just just go and do your thing. And um, I have hundreds of examples of this kind of, of, of very philosophical talk that would spontaneously erupt between all of us. Um, I speak Urdu, so that really helped when I returned because I wanted to really do something collaborative as far as portraiture and not just grab a, a moment. I really wanted to talk to the people. So many of them I hadn't met the year before, so they knew me. And we really worked on that series together to try and show uh, kind of their elevated spirit, you know, and energy. Um, and, and yeah, mostly they are men. There are some women walking, but in this case, I wanted to show the proximity of the men. Um, uh, just, um, it's, it is happening with such easy goingness and it is all deprived of, in my mind, sexuality. And, uh, and, and, and it's just a beautiful, uh, very um, uh, a journey of, of, of discovery and of love um, and it happens every year and people are very very determined and excited to redo it every year so anyway um, this is my take on this um, with this very um, strong angle towards highlighting uh, what impressed me most uh, and uh, I hope um, and uh, I'm glad you enjoyed it thank you so much